Hey, child support's not always fair. I just had a case where mom had taken dad to court. She was making uh, about $10 an hour, working 25 hours a week, menial job. Dad was working for a big corporation, putting in between 40 and 45 hours a week, making some overtime. Court hit him with $800 a month in child support. No big deal. So he goes out, he gets a second job. No big deal. I take $800, I turn out to a plane ticket to Thailand, and I flick the ex-wife off and say, good luck raising those bastards. But Chronic, you don't care about your kids? I mean, you can take the kids too if you find a, a suitcase big enough. Shit. So he's working part-time, a second job, making $15 an hour, working about 20 to 25 hours a week to offset the decrease in his income from having to pay child support. Well, guess what? They take him back to court a year later and they say, hey, we're going to hit you with another $500 a month in child support because of this second job. And men sit there and accept it. They don't do anything to fight against the system. All I'm saying is the Taliban don't let that shit fly. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now, mom's still working 20 to 25 hours a week, making 10 bucks an hour. Dad's now working between 70 and 75 a week, making overtime with the second job. And now his child support goes up another 500 bucks. Doesn't seem fair, does it? It's not fair because the feminist government of the United States of America is demonic and it should be mm, disempowered to steal and abuse men.